Hey there, it's Big Tony over here at Natchi, coming at you with a little Beacon Rush action, Ocho Kochi focused. And uh, we're going to start off here, we're on the dam map. That's right, it's Springfield. And uh, starting off here, uh, this is my Ocho, my unknown Ocho, Aramis, and Ultimate Orcans. This has been a monster beacon capper, guys. Uh, I'm, I've, I've taken the phase shift back off this, and I've put the jump module back on just just so this would be a, a decent jumping beacon capper and, of course, uh, assault style <laughs> attacks from, uh, you know, pretty significant distance. I can launch myself right at people. So this is, this is, this is actually, it's, it's a deadly build. So let's go ahead and we got a couple bots coming up towards the top. Oh, okay, we got, okay, let's give these guys a little love. Let's see if we can get the curry out of here if we can. Get that Aramis on him, get a little bit of healing. Now, the Aramis is on here are MK1 level 8s. They, these are not MK2 weapons yet, but they do some nice damage, and they keep me healing, and they keep me in the battle just a little bit longer. And that has been kind of a saving grace for this particular bot, allowing me to brawl it out with other, you know, Ochos like that and get the kill. It's, it's definitely a different build. Now, I might uh, t turn around and do a different build on this. Okay, we got a couple. Let's go ahead and go after these guys over here. Let's take the beacon, throw a little uh, rocket love their way. And, uh, I just I waited a little too long on the jump there. But that's fine. We'll still get it. What the heck? A jumping crisis. Wow, that's cool. Um, but I was talking about what I might change up on this. I might actually put the Porthos on the side and put my ultimate halos back on top. That might also be an interesting build that I'm going to have to try out here, uh, maybe sometime after the uh, weekend here. So we will, uh, we're going to blow a few things up with this. We're grinding resources. We're getting ready for 10.2 because I'm definitely I'm really grinding my way towards uh, wanting to put that new uh, bot together. And there's also a Titan. So I've got two things i got to focus my resources on. So definitely it's a grind. So let's go ahead and make the jump. All the way across the river, and we're just going to land right in the middle of their spawn point and cause mayhem and chaos. Okay, uh, I'm going to get him. He's already out of here. So let's go ahead and uh, cap the beacon. And nope, yeah, he's there. He's dead up on there. The harpy's dead. But let's, yeah, let's go get this guy. Then we'll go back for the beacon. I'm feeling very aggressive. Let's get the emoji out of here. I can still jump back up on top here. So that'll work. There's the kill. And now, yeah, let's go ahead and yeah, spin around on him. You silly, silly scorpion. Ba boom <laughs> you're out of here. And, oh, yeah, I should go for the beacon, but let's go ahead and clear a few of these guys out of here first. Let's go ahead and just tank on these guys. We've got the super majority. Looks like someone's coming for the beacon already, so that's good. Come out of phase shift, you little turkey. And we've got ourselves a Minos coming this way. Triple kill, and we get, oh yeah, I'm getting flung, that, that's, that's going to be, that is, yeah, this is not good, <laughs> getting caught in the air, come on down, come on down, there, I can go, I can go into uh, stampede mode, let's give these guys a little love, maybe we can get, yeah, let's get the Minos out of here, if we can at least get him, that would be great, uh, okay, got tanked out there, come on, come on, it turned over, let's drop it in on the A here, let's go ahead and drop the uh, ultimate fan rear, uh, yeah, they're going to have a hard time taking this thing out, so let's go ahead and Give these guys the love and just kind of just, uh, you know, keep them going here. And wow, he just went, I, d I think that was his dash ability. I hope it was because <laughs> that Eiffel just took off like a rocket. Okay, I've never seen one right underneath take off like that. But uh, we got this just about wrapped up. Super aggressive. We went for the home beacon, their spawn beacon, and we took the side beacon and just, just absolutely pounded it. Took the victory, short match, so definitely we're going to be doing uh, at least one more match for you guys. Uh, seven kills, three beaten caps, nice chunk of damage. Alrighty guys, let's hop into another one and continue on with the mayhem. Alrighty guys, here we go, we're going to hop into it. Abyss map. Okay, th this should be fun. Um, some good open spots, I just got to make sure I don't go landing out, out off the map into oblivion. Because that, that has happened a few times. Uh, especially if I run into other bots like this, I run into other Ochos, or if I run into Shells, or uh, Rooks, ones that can really do some damage, or even even the Luchador, if they get a hold of you and fling you, you can go right off the map here. So I, I, I'm tempted to go for the open space there and go for that particular beacon, but let's go ahead and let's go ahead and just kind of jump up here. Let's uh, go ahead and work away. Oh my gosh, I got a hover on my side. 
and then he just died. Okay. Oh, that's not good. That is not good, the hover. Okay, that, that, that could be some interesting times ahead. Let's go ahead and work on that behemoth right there. There's a kill. We got an angler right there. Looks like we got a Fafner, Harpy, Crisis. We got we got a lot of bots in here, so let's let's just keep it. I'm just trying to get them all tanked up here, all grouped together. That way, you know, maybe my guys can go out and get some beacons. So you can see right in the map there, they're all gathered together. So now let's go ahead and let's hit them with the Raptor. It's going to drift in here. Let's go ahead and chew these guys up. Keep them contained. We've got just about all the beacons. This is definitely a strategic uh, push right off the bat. And I've got a team, even though I was a little concerned when I saw that hover, um, we got a team that is pushing it here, so that is good. We've got all the beacons. This will actually end pretty quick. It's going to drop on him, get him out of here. And we'll get his, oh, didn't quite get his buddy there. So let's uh, solo spawn point raid it. Let's go ahead and hop over his head. We got a couple of good squishy targets back here. Let's get rid of them. And the boom, goodbye, you're out of here. We got a couple right back here. Let's get rid of him if we can. Well, at least assist. I didn't get the assist, but I did help him. Would have liked to have at least got a little recognition for that. Let's go ahead and work on. We got ourselves a fan rear. We got an Ocho. We got a little work here to do. So let's. We, ah, we kept them back here too. They're all gathered up here still. They're getting one beacon back. <laughs> Look at the power bar. This thing is almost over. We're definitely going to a third match, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and defend their home spawn point. Beacon, let's just hold it. Not going to let you have it. There's the godlike. We've got any more spawning back there. We've got a couple in front here, so let's work on them. Oh, here comes the Ocho. Let's give him a little love. And boom, there's Beyond Godlike. And what this guy, what we got here? We got Aegis Shielded Little. Yeah, we got a Lynx. But that's going to be the victory. Wow, another just a pounding quick match. Uh, just let's just take a quick look at the scores real quick. And yeah, we're going to hop into a third. Seven kills, only took one beacon cap, but really only needed to. We pushed it really hard right into their spawn point and held it there, and they just got trapped into it. All righty, guys, let's hop into a third one. This has been fun. All righty, guys, let's hop into the third match here. Power plant. That'll make things interesting. Uh, kind of a circular motion map. I like this. We'll have some fun, maybe flank a few people, and we're going to tear them up with the Ocho. Um, definitely, definitely, I tell you, this has just been a little monster. I put away one of my uh, Pathfinders. I have two Pathfinders. I moved one to my second hangar, and to move this one up from my second hangar to my first, because this thing really is a beast. Someone behind me, what do we got? Oh, he cut from My buddy in blue actually had my backside there. Sweet! Someone had my six for once. That works. Okay, let's go ahead and give me Skyrosa some love. Oh, we got one who's in ball modes and one who's not in ball mode. Okay, come on. Oh, yeah, he's going into phase shift. Come on, come on, come on. Well, one's running for the beacon. This guy here's beat up, so let's go ahead and work on him some more. If he was fully charged up, it might not be worth the time to sit there and grind on him. He's so beat up already. I think we can take him out, especially when I got a couple of my buddies in blue shooting at him as well. I will settle for the assist, but I'll take the kill. There was enough of us pounding on him. I would have accepted the assist on that one. But, hey, we'll just take what we can get. Oh, there he is. There's a Pathfinder right there. And we got ourselves a Nether. And we got ourselves... Yeah, we got some, we got some firepower here, so let's go ahead and work on getting rid of the Nether here. Or right, there's that Pathfinder. Let's give him a little love. Give you a few rockets. And now let's work on these guys. And then, ba boom goodbye. And we got another one sitting right in there. There's so much firepower, so much explosions going on, it's hard to even tell what that is. But of course, well, yeah, maybe, maybe we'll get a shot on him. That Lynx, he had the Lynx, he zipped around the corner. So let's go ahead. Oh, ho, 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 you big old Ocho. Let's give you some love. I'll release my inner Viking and just pound on you. Okay, let's, uh, oh, we're down a beacon, so let's go ahead and grab a beacon. We should do that. We went through all this, uh, you know, this brawling right here. We can at least get the beacon out of this. Angler is going into electric glide, so it's kind of step out of his range. Turn blue. Let's get rid of the Fenrir here. I don't need to be just obliterated from a little ways away while battling for the beacon. So let's get rid of him first. Come on, come on, come on. You're going to die, pal. That's how this is going to work. And come on, come on, come on, come on. And 
Ba-boom for the Rampage. Sweetness. You know what? Let's do it. Let's go for their home beacon. Let's see if we can't grab this. We've got just about all the beacons already. This is going great. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's grab this one here. And ourselves... Oh, man, we got ourselves a couple different builds here that are pretty good. We got ourselves a lot of Lynxes, and here we go. I just got executed. Yeah, Lynxes are actually very, very good if you have them. And especially if you have a team that's working in conjunction with you, they beat them up, you execute them, or vice versa. Works pretty good. Okay, we got a couple Titans out here now. Or we got at least one Titan. We got the Eiffel right there. That up there is actually that's just a Seraph. That's just a that's just a feather destrier. For a minute there I thought it was the Aether, but not quite big enough. Okay, let's go ahead and work on the Eiffel here and come on. I'll take the I'll take the assist. Ah, for sure he's my... Oh, jeez, here he comes. We got ourselves an angry luchador. Off the top ropes. Let's uh, just go ahead and jump around him here. We got a curry running. Give him a little love. Soften him up. And, oh, a typhon. There we go. That's a gimme target right there. And, ba-boom. Low-hanging fruit, folks. Typhon, I mean, if you have the right weaponry... I mean, if you have the right weaponry, the right pilot skills, and you're very careful with it, you can play the, t the typhon in Champion League. But if someone really is knowing what they're doing and how to hunt those, you can really take you can really take them to town and get rid of those typhons pretty quick. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on! So much action going on here. There we go, got him. Let's go ahead and give this guy a little love here. You're just gonna sit there, aren't ya, Piletto? ACV14. He's a he's a charging unit. I don't know. Okay, someone, okay, that's what we got back there. Is that a Muromets? Oh, what's behind me? I'm kind of in a crossfire. Got okay, a little love. And there's a Feather Destrier, a Seraph to the rescue. It's a free-to-play build there, too, guys. That has the uh, hat, the Ks on it. Boom, <laughs> let's get him out of there. Okay, let's go ahead. And we got, we, got the, we got the super majority of beacons, so I'm not too concerned about the beacons. Now it's, we're in kill mode. There's only one left. There's no way this guy here, he's bringing Ophi. There's no way he's going to get all these beacons, not with all of us coming in on him. 5v1. This game is over, guys. <laughs> We're going to play a fourth one for you guys. because I mean, really, this has been an evening of just, I mean, Blitzkrieg-style gameplay. Just absolutely dominating as far as aggressive, in-your-face, beacon capping, and quick matches. All right, let's just take a quick look at the scores, and we'll do one more for you guys. Let's go ahead and take a look here. Nine kills, three beam caps, plenty of damage, and we got through it quick. Alrighty, guys, let's do one more before we wrap this up. Alrighty, guys, last match, I promise, last match for this video. Uh, factory map, okay? This is another one where I can kind of do a circular style run. Uh, we can run back and forth to the beacons, circle around, flank people. This is just a, another fun map to run on. So, and here we have, I am very G. Oh. I don't know what very G means, but I hope that's not like Kenny G. Otherwise, we've got a saxophone player that's running loose here on the battlefield. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look here. Let's see if we got one that says YouTube up there. So we'll have to, you know, we'll have to keep in mind of that. Usually when I see, there are a lot of folks who do put out, you know, they say YouTube on the backside of their, you know, on the backside of their uh, account name, even though they, they may not be YouTube. I, I don't know. Get this guy a little love right here. Okay, so he's got he got the Demeter. He's got the uh, he's got the invincible shielding there, the impermeable shield. Okay, he's down. Yeah, he's down below that little lip right there, below the ramp. Can I get a shot? Nope. I'm gonna have to go airborne if I want him. So let's go ahead and pop up here. The beacon change. Now let's give him a little love. And ba -da -ba -da -ba boom. Goodbye. You're out of here. And oh, nice targets. Nice targets. We got ourselves, looks like a heartbeat up there. Let's go ahead and get this guy in the ground here. We got an Ophian. Let's shove him around. Get right underneath him so he has a problem shooting at me. Oh, yeah, there we go. There he is. There's my YouTube buddy right there. Let's get rid of him. And, yeah, fine. We just, it's just a spawn point raid, guys. We are just, just flinging stuff. There we go. He just got flung again. There's a Demeter, uh, my YouTube buddy. He just teleported down there for uh, that beacon. So let's go ahead and give a little help here. I'm, oh, I'm locked down. Okay. Someone's got lockdown ammo, or some sort of lockdown. But let's go ahead and get this guy a little up here, and come on, come on, come on, and boom! Goodbye, you're out of here. 
and work on the OFN here. I, I want to jump up. Can I jump up inside his shield? So close, so close, so close. Oh, not quite. If I had been just riddled, if I could have just got right in his face, or I could have been right through his shield. But I'll take the assist. That works. Okay, fine. We'll run all the way across. Let's go ahead and gotta get close. Get some rockets firing here a little bit. There we go. Now we're in range right now. So let's go ahead. Let's, let's go. And boom, the rampage. My buddy in blue should be able to secure that. And there's the YouTuber up there. Pinso. Uh, I can't really. It's a small screen. <laughs> Whoever you are, pal. Keep running. Get your beacons. Let's make this a battle. Okay, let's get rid of him for the godlike. And take the beacon. Come on in here, guys. Cap the beacon. The water is fine. Okay, we've uh, sh we've already got rid of a couple of their players. They're down to two. Looks like we're down to five. And let's go ahead and we can do the jump here. Let's just go airborne. Let's just come on in. This is what I like to do. Be totally aggressive and just blow people to pieces. So let's work on him. Yep, we're going to get the beacon. He's kind of zipped around to the side there. We got a bunch of them down there. I'm not going to worry about, I'm not going to worry too much about the Skyros. I see some targets down here, so let's go down and clear this out. I'll probably go back for that beacon behind me, but that's fine. We'll head back there if we need to. Let's see. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, and boom, Titan Slayer. Nice. Now let's get inside the circle. Take the beacon. <laughs> that's right, folks. My beacon. And that's it. That was a quick, strategic pounder. Four good matches in this video, guys, and they were all real quick, real tactical, almost surgical in the, the amount of destruction that we inflicted here. Six by six, plenty of damage. And you know what? It was a fun one. All right, guys. Hope you guys like this one. A little bit bigger than an average, but you know what? We had a lot of matches that were kind of short, so definitely wanted to make sure you had plenty to watch today. All right, guys. Time to bail out of here. I challenge you. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. I'd really appreciate it. Alrighty guys, stay safe and healthy, watch out for each other, and guys, I'll catch you on the battlefield.